we shun the sun. Hey everyone, it's David Dillon and Bud Joss here with a cast of Legacy of the Void. That's right, Starcraft Some serious, too. intense action here for you all. So intense. So up, up here we've got the old Ridlin on top left in the uh, Protoss. And Piskiny top right in the blue. Oh yeah. We've got the bagger down here. Mighty, as a Zerg. mighty bag. And the mighty bag here on the left. As we can see, we can uh, scout this probe out. He's going to come having a look. Now you know we're we're a bit shy of our skills when it's we have actually we never even sent probes out. We never sent any sort of discovery. Well, think about it. Yes, he's getting crucial intelligence <laughs> and so on and so forth, but he's still losing the minerals from that one probe. That's right. Wow. So if you're saying I'm good enough that I don't need to know what you got, I think that's just proving your confidence and your ability. That's true. I mean, like look, look at the production; it speaks for itself, doesn't it? It's insane. Bardjust's production is absolutely ridiculous right now. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing more to say, really. Oh, and he's just been blocked in. And he blocks him in. Wall him in. Every click has a purpose. That's right. You have to get in. Except See, all those you, ones. You check out the APM. And, oh, look at it. Okay. Look at all these other idiots just... Spending much... Wasting their time on all this APM. Yes. Bardjust just on a cool 37. Just taking it easy. <laughs> Let's go to the ATM here. Doesn't want to wear down the clicking finger too quick. Current, He's got a no. career ahead current of him. An average of 36, 34. Jeez, not. It's all right. He saves it for the battles. That's, That's right. What it usually Just gets conserving, the conserving energy in my trigger finger. Too well, correct me if I'm wrong. Usually in battles you hit. Is it like around 5,000? Well, yeah, you'll, you'll that's see, what I normally average. You'll yeah. see once up yeah. there. <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, we've got some gateways and a cybernetics core popping out for the old. Uh, Name Ridlin, maybe? Yeah, Ridlin. Ridlin top left and Piskany on the blue. Pretty standard, pretty standard pretty stuff. Stock standard. Hoping to see a bit more character. Yeah, oh, yeah. yeah. oh look at the bangers just popping out drones. It's always got the it's, Queen's about to come out. I mean, really, do you just throw in the towel now? <laughs> there it is. Well, I reckon this Queen's got a lot of uh it's gonna do a lot of killing, actually. I think this Queen's gonna have a lot of uh kills to her belt. Can you tell the is that your prediction? That's my prediction, yeah. Is this exact oh, yeah. coin? Yeah, this exact one. I don't argue with you. I don't argue. We'll see what happens. What have we got happening in the middle? So just a few zealots all sort of partying up for both teams. Right. Four zealots from Piscany. Apparently two out from uh, Midlands. Check the actual armies here. Yep, two and four. They're all out there though. There is one extra probe from... You know what? If you check out the units lost, you'll see some amazing stats right there. Cool. That's 50 resources down the garbage. That's really hard to recover from, to be honest. Yeah. I don't think he'll ever be able to recover. Actually, I don't think he can. actually pick structures right now. You can see why Mighty Bag it takes such a tremendous lead. <laughs> that is quite a lot of structures. That's right. And uh, still, still playing it a bit easy. That's all right. <laughs> <laughs> He's playing give off the illusion. Yeah, you got to give him off the illusion of vulnerability. That's right. That's right. Meanwhile, it's a bit of a... A force building up in the centre. Centred by the Zelnaga Tower. They're, they're trying to get themselves so ready. Are you able to see them when they go into the... No, they can see. Yeah, they gain the extra vision. That's yes. right. That's right. So they leave the one unit there smartly. No. No, they don't. Of course they yeah, don't. That, that, that could be a crucial error. I don't think they're thinking they're going to need it. They probably won't. They're fully expecting oh. this game is going to be GG within 30 seconds. I think they are. They with can't. A force like that. Especially when, we? especially when that overlord's already half damaged by the mighty bag. <laughs> <laughs> and here comes the queen, the killing spree, the assassin. Here it oh, comes. Oh, look at it. <laughs> look at it. Watch it. Look at the APM. It's outrageous. Although, oh. That queen's on. Oh, 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 oh yes. <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, look at that APM for Bajos rocketing up. Here we go. Overtaken almost everyone except Ridlin. Blocking out them zerglings there. They can't get around the back. Oh, not smart the enough. plays are just <laughs> You're so me. high level. <laughs> just go around. <laughs> uh, just tanks the zealots. Look, look at this. Here. I don't care. Up comes that I've, got one, one, I've got one attack marines, mate. And six Too easy. on the way. He's happy to lose these marines. They cost nothing. Look at these marines. That's right. Plus one attack. <laughs> Absolutely They're basically free. You're doing him a favour by killing him. Oh, look at that oh. Marauder, just sitting at the back, not taking any damage. Here we go, I'm doing a stutter step now. Oh, oh orgasmic. Oh, jeez. Oh, look, the Queen's well. back. It's like he's never gone. 
business as usual. That's right, and we're warping in a few more stalkers up here because they've realised the spires come out, so they're thinking stalkers is what's going to save them. A few more. They've realised it's going to be a rare game that goes past the uh, the five minute mark. I don't think Ridland and Piscany have ever had this happen so, before. I mean, you, you could. That him. Pretty bad. You also got your compliments that uh, Bag was able to get his units across and help out, but I mean. Was it actually the structure of the base inside the Zerg which made it so hard to navigate? If you look at where that spire is and where the, I think it was the spawning us. pool, they just couldn't get through there. They had to weave around around the back and funnel themselves into a tunnel. Basically a hedge that's, base. That's basically right. What, what Dylan's oh. basically done, he's got a tower defense thing going on in his base. It's just these <laughs> endless lanes you have to walk through to get to his... And his basically, the, the, the Protoss, the unfortunate Protoss, was sprinting down a hallway which was just filled with bullets. I'm honestly going to say, I don't even think Age was needed there. <laughs> oh, look at the stuttering. Look at them. Oh, they're, not, they're not even actually taking damage, they're just self-destructing in fear of the... Of the look minions. at that APM. <laughs> Outrageous. Look at these two. What are they thinking? Look at the current production. What, what are they thinking? The they're late to the party and they're still happy to... <laughs> look at the late call-up. Alright, yeah. Sacrifice to the mighty eye. Look at the, whatever the average called. APM right now. Bajos has taken a commanding lead. That's true. Commanding. Oh, about. that's a drop. Oh, <laughs> oh, boy. it's because I'm Tiggy Zero, just taking it easy right now. Look at the current APM by the man. <laughs> He's actually pressing cover buttons. And that's because these mutalists are flying around. Yeah. Just investigating what's yeah. going on. Oh, that's right. We got the muters. Yeah. Follow oh, these lads. They've already done some havoc around the back of this base, which we've Zerg. Oh, yeah. no, no, missed it's... with all my uh, hedge maze talk. <laughs> the mirrors are flying around the back, destroyed a few probes, a couple of lone stalkers. Oh, did they already do that? They did. Oh. That's alright, you didn't really miss much. Yeah. But uh, they have to my the band. under the belt. That's right. And that's the risk. I mean, they were really trying to target your bases then, but they probably could have been looking after their own backyard. Here we go, this mutilist got four kills. Four from another one. That's metric, that's that's not bad for a mutilist. They don't tend to have the longest lifespans. They got the rank of predator at the moment. The, those ones with four kills. Pretty impressive. Is there any higher rank? Though? Is there any lower? <laughs> well, <laughs> one with one kill, predator too. <laughs> I was about to say. Mutilist <laughs> just come safely back home. We're just taking it easy. Don't really see why they wouldn't be either. One probe sitting in the middle, that's always clever because it means you'll be able to warp in his units to be closer to your base. Yep. What he needs to be worried about is the scouting that Age and Dylan are going to start soon at the, um, usually around the nine minute mark is where they scout. Yeah, they've got a bit of force in the middle here with a few stalkers. A few stalkers, a sentry. Yeah. Yeah, they've got a, oh yeah, that sentry. Oh, there we go. Hidden away there. The units here, we've got, uh, yeah, 12, lots warping in the middle. stalkers in a mothership core against the uh, three zealots, five stalkers and one sentry. Not much Ooh, wow, here they come. Warping in the middle as well here. That, yeah, here they come. Dang. This is a pretty serious army. Here they come. We look at the production here. The evolution chamber coming out, and I will admit it's because I thought that's where I upgraded my units from, and it's not. It's that's just wasted <laughs> production. It makes them turn around. Smart play. Yep. No, I stopped that's an imminent, in, imminent attack, which... Honestly, probably the game. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Leads them on a bit of a chase. They're not questioning it. Realizes they're going to come for the overlords. They're happy to go all in. Realizes they're going to come for the overlords. Knows he's happy to sacrifice a few. Because <laughs> they're just so easy to come by. A couple of mutilists go out to die. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah. They're bait. Why, why would I they? kept my overlords alive. Didn't keep the mutilists alive. Didn't need to. How much does a mutilist cost? Nah, don't worry about oh, it. Thousands. <laughs> couple, couple grand. Nah. <laughs> Look at this. Stim pack. Look at that mutilist sitting there. Too easy. Up. Watch the APM. Jeez. Absolutely. They're trying absolutely to get the surround. They've got absolutely no idea what's going Un on. Is he really just melting like butterflies and biscuit? He just drops like the sack he is. There we go. Jeez. That Look is that. utter destruction. I thought it should be closer than that, if I'm honest. Nah. I guess I've, those marauders. I've upgraded man. my. Units there, one one. Oh, I don't know what their upgrades are. That's why you uh, the upgrades tab. He's doing just one and one so now at the were, moment. Reds were one one. They have one one. And 
Oh, okay. Uh, so Ridlin had 1-1, one, one, whilst Tiskney had charge and blink. Well, I'm surprised Didn't see him blink much, so I have to say. Yeah. Mm. As in none. But I mean, that, that is the calibre of the, of the people we vote. <laughs> and here's when I asked Bud Jones for a bit of help, and look what, that, look what happens. He just sits there. What are you doing? Let's me lose my middles. Oh. Comes in in time to hold back the stalkers, potentially. Look at him trying to bait him into using the stim. He's, he's too experienced for that. Jeez, banger. Some serious APM going on. Could not handle it. <laughs> Current APM 300. Let's <laughs> <laughs> keep buzz you. 400. 400 APM. <laughs> oh, well. That's their expansion going down, or whatever it right. is. See you later. Look at them filthy few mules just dropping my flies. Oh, I saw that. Are they distracted? They did their job. Right. When you're paired up with the Marine, usually the best you can do is with a Terran. I mean, their units can win you the game anyway. It's pretty much always going to be 2v1. You can just be a bullet magnet for them for even a few seconds. <laughs> pretty much the best that Protoss or Zerg can hope for. I don't even think these Marines needed to use still. <laughs> I can't a few more. Pretty, that's a pretty crushing blow for them there, I have to say. Meanwhile, oh yeah. Okay, how many bases have we got? Has Age expanded? I don't think he has. I'm starting just sending, sending it over now. Dave just puts the oh yeah. Didn't want to say anything, but I would have expected that a bit earlier than this. Oh, it just shows my caliber. I can take him on just on one base. <laughs> Doesn't need two bases. Usually, I need two usually bases. Usually, would be on to his fourth or fifth base by now. In any normal and game. normally, I give you know just a bit of a handicap. You know, I don't expand for. What oh, minute are we? Okay. 12. Yeah, 12 minutes are normally. Yeah. Just to go okay, easy. Okay, have they changed the mule things? Because I remember you used to only be allowed one. Yeah, but I had heaps of energy. Same. Oh, right. <laughs> that looks hilarious. Yeah, so you to say, Doug, you just throw them all down. Not bad at all. You get some serious income. Oh, look at them. So what's the, the, what's the backup plan here for Ridlin and... Well, what have they got what? coming? Just amassing, got a lot of cake. amassing zealots for the marines and getting some stalkers here for the mutalisks. Fair few Lots zealots coming out. They've got, they've got Lots Protoss of shields cannon. level 1 being researched right now. Not much to deal with the mutalisks right now though. Yeah, only a couple yeah. of stalkers. They've got, too much, they've got far too much ground. They come. Not that impressed just yet with what uh, with what they're doing. But the uh, the mutalisks obviously made them nervous given the photon cannons. I, I'm sure that's fine. Yeah. He's charged Alice doing a bit of damage, but no. I can't believe how long, long I've lasted. Long time ago. True. Did, did good damage there. And the mutil is coming at just the right time. Gives him the false sense of security. Look at him, makes him run away. Well, they've mostly gone zealots there as well. Exactly. Oh. Oh, oh, look at that. Rope plays. That really stings. <laughs> Meanwhile, what army are you? Oh, yeah. Age is building up a few more marines, etc. Yeah, damn. It's no worries. Attack wave worms. Just flying around. Destruction. Click on the structures tab. It's no surprise. And look, what's that? That's four bases up for the banger now. Four bases. Unbelievable. Units lost. Take a look at Ridland. How's that for some fine reading? Oh goodness gracious me! He's lost twelve thousand resources. Yeah, yeah, actually, I can't count that high. Want to want to look at it? It's forty-one lost for the banger. Almost double from eight. Almost lost <laughs> double my units. I'm pretty sure Dylan's only built 42. <laughs> <laughs> now, I'm not saying <laughs> that that's what makes me the better player. Because I don't lose my units. But it could be because Adrian was storming into the base while I was sitting at the back, back chilling. <laughs> Active forces. Okay. Oh, so, it uh, looks like Piskin is finally thought. It's time to get the third base going. Or is it actually the fourth? That is the fourth that's, base. That's his fourth. Jeez. Is he stretching a bit thin? We will find out. Meanwhile, Piscany going for the high yield minerals. He's not worried. Well, that's his only source of income at the moment. He's got nothing else. That is actually a very good point. Yeah, he he should probably something. consider bringing some of those probes over because they're going absolutely overtime on the one mineral patch. And you can thank the Mutalisks. Well, right now, Piscany 
Doesn't look concerned. Yeah. I think he thinks he's in for a fine time here. Just, just leaves four stalkers semi in the base. Not even too worried. Actually, speaking of four bases, that's exactly what Dylan's got now as well. Oh, I had that a long time ago. Oh, they're not, well. they're not very well managed. But, but, there, but there's four. Of I was going to say, one of them's just got the, the best being gas. Well, I had to make sure. Two of them do. I had to make sure because gas is where I was running low. Gas is what Clearly, we need see, for the muters. One of your other bases is no minerals as well. It's just the gas. <laughs> but that's okay. It doesn't matter. It never matters. What's that? Is plenty disruptors. of your. Uh, What's a disruptor? You've plenty of drones sitting at one of your base doing nothing too. I don't even know what disruptors are. Disruptors, you say? Disruptors. Warping with the old uh, Ridlin getting one in. Here it comes. Out it pops. Which base? The red one is now in the middle. Look at that. He looks like a walking pylon. Oh, yeah. That were those things that I was talking about. I had no idea. Okay, what's his move? Shoots out a ball of energy that lasts two seconds. And does splash damage. 145 Interesting. splash damage. That's a lot of damage when you consider a stalker only has 80 HP. That's true. Yeah. With 80 You'll shield. see it a bit later. Can play. they attack air though? How do you find it? It sounds good, but. How do you find out if they can attack air? Um. I reckon maybe the red base will tell me. Can attack ground units only. See? There you go. And what do you think? Here we go. That's not exactly wise. Army. Comes the force. 43 mutalists are coming. Here we go. Here Is go. the disruptor going to attempt crushing. something here? The disruptor. He's gone right to the back of the pack. He's, he's down. <laughs> I didn't know what it was, so I made sure we targeted it. And look at that. It's just destruction. There's still 38 mutalists up there. 25 marines. 17 marauders. 10 18,000 resources lost. For Ridland. And look at that APM right now. The Zerg just takes a dud! Right, nah, there goes one of them. I better change that back before it, uh. <laughs> look at these other disruptors! <laughs> Ridland brings out another one to die. And we just go, How's your father? See you later. Come back tomorrow. <laughs> See you next Tuesday. <laughs> this is almost depressing to watch. Oh, yes. Look at them all sitting outside the base, just pondering what could have been. And yeah, they'll just steamroll. Finally rolling. decide to move in, but it's too yeah, late. Down go the pylons. All production is It's stopped. far too late. Yeah, if you there's keep an eye on the, the um, GG coming. The disruptor will use his thing ah, let's watch very soon. Let's watch him. He's got a couple of them out now. There he comes. Go. Yeah, that was oh, there it goes. damage. It was. Unfortunately, Huge. the damage couldn't hit the air. Because in comes the damage to the save the day yet again. They've GG'd. That's game to wish out the sun and back. <laughs> and an almost 24,000 resource lost for Ridlin. Should be absolutely ashamed of his performance. If you look at the overall APM at the end. I mean, 81 for myself, 85 for Budgers. Because I suppose he was, he was just spending his last few seconds mashing R, raising and lowering <laughs> his supply depots. <laughs> I think most of Ridland's APM came from trying to click on the menu so he could surrender. Units, but he just units couldn't lost. find it. I just I made yeah, such at, work of my resources. Maybe you can check out the structures and you'll see his standard just Budgers carrying the team. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so from all of us here at We Shun the Sun, we hope to see you next time on the next time. We managed to actually beat someone. <laughs> <laughs> Might be about seven games. Seventeen. Seven games time. Oh.